Hi, I'm Véronique. Welcome to this breathwork session. You can do this session either sitting cross-legged on the floor or uh, sitting on a chair. So let's start by uh, drawing our awareness to the way we are sitting. So I invite you to close your eyes and just notice all the parts of your body that are in contact with the floor or your chair. Noticing if you are maybe putting more weight on one side or the other or more forward or backwards. And then adjusting by moving your legs. So from the waist downwards, we are grounding into the floor. And from the waist upwards, we are lengthening. So lengthening the spine, but keeping the shoulders down, away from the ears. And bring your awareness now to your breath. If possible, please breathe in and out through the nose. With the eyes closed, inhale and on the next exhale, turn your head to your right, slowly moving with the breath and inhale back to center. Exhale, turn the head to your left. And inhale back to center. Once more. Exhale, turning the head to your right. Inhaling to center. Exhale, head to your left. And inhaling back to center. Now circling the head. Gentle circles. Small circles clockwise. Noticing any sensations in your throat as you're doing that. Being very careful if your neck is sensitive and then anti-clockwise. Back to center. Roll your shoulders back and then forward. And next, I'd like you to extend your arms in a V shape and stretch. Open your mouth and breathe in through the mouth. That might trigger a yawn. Oh. And exhale. Bring your hands in front of your heart and smile. Three seconds. And release. Once more. Stretch. Open the mouth, yawn. Oh. And exhale, hands in prayer position. Smiling for three seconds. Release your hands on your knees or on your laps. And close your eyes again. And I invite you to note the changing sensations in your body as you breathe in and out through the nose. Tune into the subtle differences between the inhalation and the exhalation. How does it feel to inhale? How does it feel to exhale? How do you know which one you're doing? And which parts of the body are moving as you breathe in and out? So usually we feel Mostly the sensations in the abdomen, the chest, or the nostrils. But maybe you feel sensations in other parts of the body. Just be curious.
For the moment, don't make any attempt to regulate your breath. Just observe. And allow the breath to come in and out on its own. So some breath will be deep, others will be shallow. That's fine. Just notice the difference. And now imagine that you've got a wide belt around the waist. So the bottom of the, very, the rib cage and the upper abdomen. And as you inhale, you inhale into this belt, expanding the belt to the front, the side and the back. And as you exhale, releasing. So feeling the waist expand on the inhale and release on the exhale. Again, inhale, expand, exhale, release. And if you want, you can place your hands on your abdomen to feel the expansion on the inhale and the release on the exhale. Then move your hands to the sides. Again, feel the expansion on the inhale. And the release on the exhale. And if you can reach and place your hand in your back. As you inhale next time, feel your breath pushing your hand away. Exhale, release. more of these, inhaling, feeling the expansion and exhaling the release. Last time. And come back to your natural breath. So next we're going to practice a technique that is called coherent breath. So we're going to inhale through the nose and exhale through the nose or if your nose is blocked you can also exhale through the mouth. And we're going to inhale and exhale without pause at the end of the inhale or at the end of the exhale. So it's a continuous, continuous loop. And we'll start inhaling on the count of four and exhaling on the count of four. We'll do that for a few rounds and then we'll increase to inhaling on the count of five and exhaling on the count of five. So relaxing again, your shoulders away from the ears, lengthening the spine. Let's start with an exhale. And then Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two. Three, four. Three, four, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Last one, inhale, exhale. Come back to your natural breath just for a moment.
And next we're going to increase and breathe in and out on the count of five. If that is too challenging, then uh, do on the count of four. Exhaling, and then inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, last one, inhale, exhale, and come back to your natural breath. Don't try to control anything. Just let your body be breathed. And imagine that you are watching the rise and fall of the ocean swells, gently moving up and down. And let your breath embody this gentle rhythm. And begin to sink further and further inside your body into the depth of the sensations. Offering your mind a vacation, no more thinking, no more judging, no more planning. Just relaxing and following this gentle movement of the breath. So the technique we, uh, we practice, coherent breath, is also, it's very good if you suffer from insomnia or anxiety or depression, for stress in general, and also if you uh, have some attention deficit. And an alternative name for this practice is 365, because it's advised to do it three times a day, six breaths per minute, which means counting uh, on the count of five, and for five minutes each time. So that's something you can try out, three, six, five, and see how you feel. I hope you enjoyed it.